Campaign 2020 caps off in Michigan next Tuesday when voters head to the polls for the primary. Detroit officials have some advice when heading to the ballot box. CW50's April Morton has more. With Michigan's presidential primary just five days away, City Clerk Janice Winfrey lays out everything voters need to know. Some voters in Detroit getting out early ahead of next week's primary. The city says since the passing of Proposal 3, voters do not need a reason to vote absentee. City Clerk Janice Winfrey says this is a major incentive in getting people to the polls. No one will be denied the right to vote. If an individual is 18, a U.S. citizen, and register, they should be allowed to vote. Winfrey says the only exception is if a person tries to register without proof of residency. She also says with the passing of Proposal 3, there is no voter registration deadline, meaning you can register and vote the very same day. We've done everything there is to do to get that vote out. And getting that vote out, Winfrey says, is very important to her office. That's why many are encouraged to vote early if possible, although this can be concerning if a candidate drops out the race. Winfrey says if you've already filled out an absentee ballot, there's no worries. You still have time to make changes. You can spoil your ballot up to Monday, the day before elections, up till 4 o'clock Monday. Also, in an effort to make the voting process go smooth on election day, each polling site received new machines. Those devices will process the ballot faster and recognizes any errors. Winfrey says extra staff will also be on hand in case they encounter any polling issues. In Detroit, April Morton, CW50 News at 10.